From your catalog item, go to the variables related list. Push the new button. From the type box, select the select box. Give the variable an order. The order will decide where the variable appears on the form. Write a question. This will be the question that you're selecting the choice for. After entering the question, a name will be auto-entered. You can change this if you like to. The name is used for scripting, while the question is what the user will see. Right-click in the gray area and push the Save button. If you want to push the Submit button, you can. If you do, just simply scroll to the bottom and click on the variable again to open it up. Now, in order to make this function, you'll need to add some choices. At the related list, labeled Question Choices at the bottom, push the New button. In the text column, write the text that you would like the user to see. In the Value field, add the value that you would like to be represented on the technical side. This can be the same as the text value in many cases. Push the Submit button. Now we'll simply add another option. Now, check your catalog item in the portal. You'll see we have a select box with our options. 